Welcome to Invitrix Therapeutics. Uh, this is our new home in Irvine, California. This is our new uh, laboratory facility. The company started after about uh, 20 years of our experience in academia. We had a chance to go on a sabbatical in uh, Brazil. We managed to grow this uh, laboratory facility where we uh, cultured these cells to grow skin for burn patients and patients with diabetic like us. We are cognizant of the ethical issues surrounding embryonic stem cell. Uh, and having said that, we have introduced a, a brand new technology from a scientific standpoint where we can basically take uh, one of your skin cells, inject four different genes, and revert your own cells to an embryonic state. So that really uh, sort of gives us a chance to walk away from this uh, controversy. Having said that, we are uh, the only company that has introduced this in the cosmetic arena globally. We are a world leader in uh, this technology. The idea for uh, Riluma came about by serendipity. At the time, we were uh, housed in a uh, company that produced supplements. They had a European distributor that was visiting them uh, he managed to get his hand on our unformulated product. Upon his return, two, three months later, he came back to report to us that uh, his skin has significantly improved from using this uh, product. The gold color uh, bottles uh, that you see here, they are, this is a preliminary or the primary steps before the product is formulated. This is a uh, in vitro facilities where we grow the cells here, as you can tell, uh, we have uh, a biological safety hood, we have incubators. We are here in the laboratory, I wanted to take a couple of minutes and show you our incubators where we keep our cells. This is uh, an example, we grow these uh, patient cells in this what we call a T75 cell culture flask. We monitor uh, these cells on a daily basis and here uh, one can uh, basically see how these cells uh, divide in culture. This is a time-lapse uh, photography. Some of these uh, shiny cells that you see here are what we call mitotic indexes. If you really follow this single cell, soon she'll become two daughter cells, identical. This is one of the most important aspects of stem cells that they have the ability to self-renew. The second aspect of a stem cell is that they have the ability to also differentiate to different cell type and tissue type. This is where we store our stem cell. This is a liquid nitrogen freezer. This is very cold. This is at minus 132 Celsius. And as you can see here, we have stored many of our patient cells here for very long time. And these cells will be alive for long, long time, as long as we supply these uh, cells with this liquid nitrogen, these cells will probably will live for almost forever. I'd also like to take the opportunity to show you our uh, brand new operating room. This is going to be an area where we uh, are calling Center of Excellence for Stem Cell Therapy, where we are going to take some of these stem cell ideas that we have to go after treating some of the hard to cure diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson that currently we are uh, managing to do some uh, small procedures in plastics and orthopedic surgery arena.